Most days, these forklifts carry heavy bales of hay. Today, political messages pleading for help for vegetable and tobacco farmers, fighting for dignity. In Spain, food prices have remained low for decades, while production costs have gone up. Farms have shut down, and farmers are asking their political leaders to step in. We have been charging the same prices for our products for 30 years, and we can't go on like this. Enough is enough. With tobacco, 30 years ago, we earned 3 euros 40 per kilo, and now it's down to 2.30. No doubt, Brussels will hear the farmers' voices, but still, their subsidies might get cut. After all, agriculture contributed only 1.1 percent to the bloc's gross domestic product, while subsidies to the sector account for 38 percent of spending. In France, protests have started in November and never really stopped. All we know is that, unfortunately, if you look at the prices we sell our produce for, we need those subsidies to survive right now. That's the only thing we know for certain. Ahead of Thursday's EU summit, leaders are divided over the size of the budget and spending priorities. The farmers are doing all they can to help them make up their minds.